Leakage wave guide type plastic optical fiber humidity sensor using dido pro 12 polymers as cladding. Utah Shimera University of Yamanashi wave presentation. Humidity sensing is required in various fields. So several measurement methods have been researched and developed. One of them is the plastic optical fiber humidity sensor. Both sensors have a variety of features. In our laboratory, we are developing a poor humidity sensors using several polymers as for the cladding. The sensor is composed of a core with a constant reflective index and a cladding whose reflective index decreases with moisture. The change in the waveguide form of light passing through the core due to the change in reflective index is used to sense humidity. There are two states of the waveguide form. In the leaky mode, the reflective index of the cladding is larger than that of the core and light propagates through leakage by plenary reflection. In the waveguide mode, the reflective index of the cladding becomes smaller than that of the core and light with an angle of incidence greater than the critical angle propagates by total reflection. We have been using the waveguide mode for our measurements because of its large rate of change. In leaky mode, the rate of change was small and measurement from low humidity was not possible. Therefore, I decided to increase the reflectivity of plenary reflection by improving the linearity of the core. As can be seen from the equation, the core with the distortion removed by the was used because the reflectivity would be small unless theta was increased. This increases the rate of change of the transmitted light intensity in leaky mode. And we thought that we could use it as a new measurable range. Comparison of a bend sensor and a straight sensor. The results show that the transmitted light intensity of the straight sensor changes in the leaky mode. The humidity characteristics of a sensor with a dye L2 increase sensitivity are shown. This graph is normalized with the lowest value being 1. It can be confirmed that the sensitivity of the sensor has increased and the transition point from leakage mode to waveguide mode is closer to the high humidity side. The humidity characteristic of a sensor with additional dyes are shown. It can be confirmed that the turning point is even closer to the high humidity side and can be measured from 0%. Finally, conclusion of this study is present 